So your new body makes you the ideal candidate. Is the fleet prepared? Yes, my lord. As soon as you give the order, the launch sequence will begin. The planet Khan does not exist. You are lying. There. Give me a way to keep the sisterhood of Khan safe. We shall launch a fleet towards the planet immediately. You are under arrest by order of the Jidu and the Shadow Corporation. He's trying to escape! Ow! Doctor! Commander! I have located my first target! Earth! Master, that is coordinates are changing. What, 2K9? So 3, what a spiral. Earth? A rocket mob is possibly one there. Earth has never been under the greatest protection from alien threats. Why not start off with the weaker planets? We've got an incoming transmission! Captain! We have suffered heavy losses. We have contacted the proclamation, but they will be unable to set up another fleet for a while. You did what you could. Good luck. Dead. It looks as if it's up to us now. But what can we do? Wait a minute! What? Well, we're following our other self's TARDIS through the vortex. Mobius's fleet will need to follow it, yes? Oh well, yes, but their ships don't have time travel capabilities. Exactly! So the TARDIS will have to set up an arbitrary field around the fleet to pull it through the time vortex. Precisely! So if we could get control of the TARDIS, we could send the fleet hurtling through time and space and completely knock them off course. What an excellent idea. I have to get in contact with our other self. Contact. 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 We have successfully defeated the Jadoon. Excellent! I shall prepare the TARDIS's orbitary fill to bring you through the vortex. Understood. You could have saved yourself this trouble, Doctor, if only you agreed to help me with my time experiments. The controls of this machine are becoming more straightforward. Once I have mastered it, I shall pull it apart to see exactly how it works. So you can build your own. Exactly, Doctor. Why be in control of the universe when I can be ruler of all time? An army of followers from every time and place. But you will need to set up an arbitrary field before you can conquer anyone. Which is why I need you to do it for me. No more Kill the woman! Alright! Stop! Now, Doctor. Doctor, you can't help him! I'm sorry, Donna. But you can't! He'll kill everyone! Mum? Granddad? Do you think I don't know that? Morbius holds all the cards. Congratulations, Doctor! You have helped a noble cause! A new society of Time Lords will exist thanks to you. Oh, I wouldn't thank me. You see, I'm very clever. Brilliant, in fact. And my other selves have been working their socks off to stop you. This is all a trap, Morbius. Tell your guards to put down their weapons. You're defeated. What are you talking about? What trickery is this? No trickery, Morbius. The TARDIS is in a state of grace. Your weapons can't work in here. Come on! Hold on! Now I'm gonna let go. Steady! Come on, old girl. You can do it. Right! Let go! You what? Let go! Yeah, I heard what he said. You must be mad of your mind if you think I'm letting go of this. K9! Master? Apologies, mistress. She's in! It's too late, Morbius! It's over! Never! I won't let you stop me now! I've waited too long! Ah! Doctor! Doctor! No, no, listen. I'm sorry! What's happened? Where's Morbius? What's happened, my dear boy? Hmm? Morbius is dead. He's fallen through the vortex. What about the fleet? Get him with it now! Where's Donna? Is she alright? 
Oh, I'm fine. It's not like I've been sucked out into space or anything. Sorry about that. I had to turn the TARDIS' shields off so I could get rid of Morbius. You could have warned me. What about the fleet? Still in orbitary field. They can get rid of it quickly before they work out what's going on. Oh, don't worry. I know exactly where to send them. Right, lowering orbitary field. Lord Morbius? What is happening? Systems detect that this is the wrong space time zone. That's right, Commander. This is the Doctor speaking. Where is Morbius, Time Lord? Falling through time and space. Your leader is dead. Then we shall fight in his name. We shall be the new Time Lords and our mighty fleet shall obliterate you! I knew you were going to say that. You cults are so predictable. But you made one mistake. A very big one, in fact. You attempted to taint the name of my species. One of the greatest races that ever lived, and yeah, of course, they are their force. But that doesn't mean you can mess with time. Not while I'm around. Are you threatening us, Doctor? One solitary Time Lord against the cult of Morbius? Oh, this isn't a threat. I'm telling you. Goodbye. I thank you for flying with Time Lord Airlines. The main attraction should take place any second now. I'll let you work out when you are. Systems over in! All of the Ice Warriors are dead, sir! The heat's killed them! No. Event one! Do you know where he was going? I know what I would have done with them. Doris materializing, Master. Doctor, you're alright! Oh, what was that for? Sucking me out of the TARDIS. I'm glad you're back, though. Me too. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. Well done. All of you. You two. I take it the fleet is gone. Well, I have to say that was very impressive. Yes, very impressive indeed. Thank you. Doctor, as nice as it's been to meet me, I do think it best we got back to our own time streams. Yes, this does tend to cause rather a lot of problems. The Time Lords would be amused if I've broken their sentence either. Oh, yes! The exiled to Earth! You were exiled? Well, you know me. We always meddling and getting into trouble. But how can we get back? Our TARDIS is of no power, remember? The Time Scoop. It must still be in Morbius' base. Of course! I'll set up this Time Scoop and send you all back to your proper times and places. Ah, excellent. A quick little adventure and then home in time for tea. Goodbye. Nice to meet me. Yes, well, it's been interesting. Hasn't it been interesting, K9? Time distortion has been a most interesting experience in the fluctuation of temporal... Come along, K9. Oh, and here. Don't eat them all at once. Bye-bye! Cheerio. Oh, and please do something about the console room. The grey model is much more... me. Well, cheerio. <laughs> nice to see you again. Goodbye. You did rather well, my dear fellow. Very well. Well, well, goodbye. Good luck. I'm sorry. With everything. People may not know it, but you're going to be fantastic. Oh, well, uh, thank you. Poor guy. Look at him. Going off so open face with no idea what lies ahead. Well, we best be off. Go on, Donna. Well, you best come with us. Yes, being sucked out of time isn't the most enjoyable way to travel. Blimey. Yeah, this is just the start of it. Come on. See you later. That'll do it. Okay, ready? Along Z! Haha, we have liftoff! Is that it? Well, it's nothing too amazing. They'll all end up from whence they came. The time stream will sort itself out and forget any of this happened. There's so much trouble otherwise. Right, so it's time for you too. Yes, well, goodbye, old chap. Goodbye. Oh, and take care of Bessie, and give my regards to the Brigadier. Oh, and Joe, and Sergeant Benson, and Captain Yates. Bessie? Yes, my, my car. You named your car? Gone. I've got to say, right, you weren't half odd when you were younger. I mean, now you're just skinny, but what's up with them? Was the one in the velvet coat and cravat wearing a wig? Sorry. Right. Let's get out of here. What have you done? I set the time trip to overload so no one can mess around with the time stream again. Plus, you'll get rid of this lot. But this is you. Your race. They died, Donna. 
and I wouldn't want to see them connected to the slaughter that took place today. <laughs> There's enough bloodshed in their time. They're things that they shouldn't be remembered for. Come on. All of your, what, incarnations? Well, they were alone. What? Well, I mean, you've travelled with Rose and Martha, but apart from the one who had a dog, and no offence, but boy, he was Oz, but you were alone. You've lived so long just without anyone. Oh, Donna. I was never alone. Doctor! Doctor, what happened? We were here one second, and then the next it was as if everything had disappeared. Yes. Like we were nowhere. Yes, all right, all right. Calm down, the pair of you. What does me? Uh, there's just a slight time skip. Time skip? Yes, Chesterton. Now let me get back to the instruments. Doctor! Oh, JB, you're safe. Why, of course I am. Well, where did you go? I mean, I didn't go anywhere. You were the one who disappeared. What? Well, we were traveling in the TARDIS like this, and then the next minute everything went black. Then everything was back to normal. I see. Maybe some sort of temporal blackout. Hey, what are you talking about? Oh, nothing, JB. Uh, don't worry about it. Now, let's see. I'm hungry. Doctor! Joe? Lethbridge Stewart? Really, Doctor, I must insist you be more careful with that wretched machine. I don't follow. Well, you were stood right here talking to me about the dematerialization circuit, and then suddenly you were gone. Gone? Only for a split second, mind you. But I haven't been anywhere. Really, Doctor, you're wasting your time with that machine of yours. More trouble than it's worth. What are the readings, K9? All readings are normal, Master. Wonderful. We really must sort out that holiday. Ah, that's pretty. Tegan? Hello? Doctor? We're back. Yes, sorry about that. That's it. That's your explanation. We don't really want me to go into all the ins and outs of the temporal anomalies that... No, you're right. Yeah, you see, still, that was rather odd. Maybe a slight anomaly, perhaps? Whatever, Doctor. Professor! Ace! What happened? Oh, the thing. I'll explain later. But right now, though... What was that? Did I just black out or something? No, I did too. Strange. Perhaps a chronal energy wave passed through the vortex. But everything is alright, isn't it? Oh, it should be fine. Still, with everything that's happened recently, we'd best keep our eye on it. Where were you? Oh, settled down. I thought I'd lost you. Me? Nah, I've not been anywhere. But it was like everything went black. Nah, just some slight time travel stuff. Nothing to worry about. No. Hi then, onwards and upwards. And on Z. Oh yes!